Hello and welcome back to Dicey Dungeons and Buddy Veronis. We are back for the elimination round once more here for the robot. And it did not go so well last time. Let's just say that. And I don't know what she was saying there. It looks like it was something new though. Okay, so last time we played, it was a struggle. For the first like three rounds we played that, that episode. And we played like what, four probably? Um, it's the problem with this character is that one, it's very random, but it's all random, right? It's all random. It's all, uh, it's always random, but it's, it's, I don't know. It just feels more so this way when you're rolling one at a time. I don't know. The dice rolls are always random. It just doesn't like, maybe it's just the loadout, you know, maybe it's just the things, the things that this character can do are the problem. I mean, again, once we get to the point of having, uh, the buster sword as a backup thing, that's huge. Uh, I think I just play that. I didn't get lucky there. Yeah, that works. But I think this time around, the strategy. Last time around, oh god, I gotta play one of these. Yeah, I'll just do it. Um, the strategy was to play fast. That was my overall from the very get go. Was to play fast. And this time around, we're gonna take it easy. We're gonna take it easier to play it smart, play it thorough, because apparently I was missing some rolls last time, according to some of the comments. But I don't know. It's po I mean, anything's possible. Anything's possible at all. Ugh, yuck. Bad roll. Uh, let's get some block on there, I guess. Hey, lucky shot that. Then this. All right, down to one. See, this is going okay. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna spend a lot of time thinking it through. We're just gonna play. We're just gonna play. We're just gonna play. We're not gonna try to fast. We're gonna try to pay attention. Try to get it right. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do every single thing. No misplays. No misplays this time around. So this guy does not do any damage. I think we go through this guy and see how it goes. Yep, I think we do wizard first, see how it goes. Then after wizard, we can just assess. So that's pretty decent. It's also pretty decent. Let's roll it. Let's do that. It's not bad. Throw it on there. All right. He's a little scary. He's got some pretty decent things he can do. See, I think once we get the CPU up on this character, it's not so bad. And then once we get the, the Buster Sword, it gives us a, a final attack. Uh, I guess we just throw it there. Hey, it's a nice one. Okay, so we can do a uh, lucky shot. Throw three in there. All right. Got a four lock, three equipment. Oh, we didn't do that, though. He thinks he's going to survive. Okay. We got to do 11 damage here. We can do it. There's three. There's one. There's three, so we're at six damage. Seven damage if we play it here. Three, two, threes here and one there. Uh, let's start getting those threes out there. And we hope for a four roll here. Uh, we still don't have enough. So yeah, we have three here. We're gonna do that, because we're gonna take another turn here no matter what. Yeah. Gets two dice now. He can do some serious damage. Done the dodge, okay. He doesn't play it smart though. Gotta give him that. So he dodges the next attack. Let's do that. There, perfect. Okay, all right, one more battle and we have to level up. Uh, probably would make sense to go after... We have full health. Tell you what, we're going to have full health coming, coming off of this guy too. So let's kill him. We'll level up. Then we'll go after Marshmallow. We'll have two uh, healings there too. If we take any damage against him, which we will. We definitely will against him. We actually got pretty lucky there. So far, okay. So, for, so as I was saying, this is kind of a random... Uh, pretty random character to play with. That's a nice one. 
and it's 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 all comes down to the dice rolls. 100%. We don't get a lot of loot early on, and we have to keep our target right on point. And it's not like just like most of the characters. It's about getting like high rolls. This character is like getting the exact rolls. That's I think that maybe that's the difference as far as what I mean by luck, because it is all luck, really. But we're also getting some favorable enemy rolls here so far. Like that was huge. That could have gone much differently. Only thing I do is that was that was actually bad. Rolling two sixes is typically lucky for most characters that can do high damage, like a warrior. The robot's more exacting. We might lose this actually. How much does he have left? He has eight with one dice. He can't win. So now he could get away. Likely we'll get away next turn. We just gotta do five damage here. That'll do it. All right. See, like I said, we're not gonna play fast. We're just gonna play good and get it done. Take the Buster Sword. I don't think there's any other way around that. Mechanical Arm. We decided Mechanical Arm is more valuable than... I think it's more valuable than Plasma Blaster. On average, it's gonna do more damage. I think what we decided last time. I think we went the other way around with it before. There's a six. So we hang on to that for this. So three for over here. All right. Well, didn't end up being any worse. He rolled very well for himself. Extremely well for himself. All right, we got to I think we got to auto roll here. We regen it. We could take two and put five there. Put an even there. Take two and take a four there for five. Not great damage. Put that there and put this here. Not great damage, but next turn we will win. And he got a pretty decent roll that time. Not, not too bad, I guess. All right, let's um, let's not auto roll yet. Yeah, I guess now we auto roll. God, same kind of thing as last time. We still got to do ten to him. Let's see, if I do hit, regenerate three, we get three back. I should probably just take the two damage, play the five and lucky shot, I would imagine. All right, so now we're gonna have, what? 13 health going to the next battle. So this was not a good one. This guy really wore us down. It's gonna take some luck from here on out. We got the shop. All right. Your healing crystal is pretty solid. I need it. I need it actually because I'm in trouble. We have that equipped already. Okay. All right. Okay. That's what we'll do. And we did get lucky with some healing right away here. I think we got to take it. We have to get through two of these enemies to level up. We'll do one healing here so we can make sure we get through the pirate because he could be tough. This guy's also very tough. We have a bad, we have a bad map this time around. That's what's going to kill us here. A bad map. Unless we can get through this with some good rolling. It doesn't seem likely though. Got to focus on a heal every single turn. I think I do this regardless. I think we take the damage this turn. Yeah. That's a pretty decent roll for us. He's gonna get two burn. We're gonna take it. We're gonna take the damage to get the damage from him. Let's recover that. Oh shoot, that's okay. We'll do one more turn here. That said, if we were if we were taking the damage, like self took the damage, that's okay. Actually, now that now that actually has to that shook out, we're okay with that. Like we auto roll that, we get the healing. We need to do six to him so I can recover. Oh, I can't recover much of anything here. Um, I can do. I gotta take two into the six to him. Yep, gotta take two into the six. 
The problem is going into the troll there, or whatever his name is. Bully. Um, we are gonna have some problems. Cheat code increases the jackpot range this turn. That is kind of helpful. More value than the small shield, probably. I've not been play playing that one. I would play this one pretty much all the time. Okay. Let's go after the bully. And hope for the best. He has some devastating attacks. He's got that rock move. He gets once per battle. It's it's he could do up to eight damage with each of these. So he's got eight times or nine damage times three times four. In his in his in his moves right there. We'll put that there. We might as well just take it. Oh my god, that was unlucky. We got lucky there at least. He'll burn his rocks. He didn't burn his rocks. Okay. All right. He didn't burn his rocks. He could kill his next turn though. Uh, let's auto roll. We got to regen. We take the four there and the four here. Okay. Oof. Good roll. Good roll. Yep, he's playing it smart. He's playing it real smart. Got to auto roll that. Got to heal back. Got to regen with that. That's as good as we can get. He still could kill us this turn. Uh, we have five rolls. We can put it even in there. We have a four for there and a two for here. And we're in trouble. He's got eight damage plus three. Oh, he's got enough. Oh my god, he didn't do that right. He could have killed us. Okay. We level up here, so I should I should do lucky shot. Because we are gonna level up here. Now we just need to do seven damage. We have seven damage. We got six damage right there. Okay, we got one damage. Got it. Oh my god. That was that was the one that we had to get through. That was the one because now we don't get Esper CPU. That was the one. As long as we can get through that one, we're going to be set for a little while here, I think. I didn't get a chance to play cheat code yet. It hasn't come in handy. We'll see. It might. All right. We got a six. Well, we put it there eventually. We can hold off, though, for now. I think that's good damage there, actually. Okay. It doesn't end up being any different, so we can play that at the end or before, it doesn't really matter. I guess keep our options open just in case, is the idea. Two shock, okay, nice. Good good for you. No healing back, even though I probably want to. Okay, um... It's kind of formulating a game plan here. With the four in here, Put the three in there for seven damage, plus the six in here for another four damage, so that's 11 damage. Plus the five, I can do 16 damage. That's probably where to go. What did I say? Put the four in here, put the three in here, put the six in here. All right. What do we got? He rolled it. He didn't roll too good. He got a, she got a lot of damage on us though, she. Okay. Got a five up there for the buster sword. Got a six up here for the buster sword. We can put a five here for the three. Probably do that right away. Maybe we roll a two here? Oh, it'd be so nice, okay. Let's do that, let's do... We gotta win here, we gotta win here. We're gonna heal back, but we gotta win. More important. Okay. Alright, what do we got? A spatula is pretty decent. I would consider that. That usually opens things up nicely for us. Okay, I'm going to buy that. I'm going to put it in place of the cheat code. We haven't actually, we never even used the cheat code. And then upgrading. Usually we've been going with like spatula upgrades or mechanical arm upgrades. I think the 
Buster Sword upgrade might be what we do, though. I don't know. It seems so simple. I don't know. I think Spatula. I think Spatula is more, more, kind of cru more crucial. Gives us more options. We can heal with it. We can, we can attack with it. We have to get through Aurora or Cactus. Aurora is going to be tougher than Cactus, but we got to get through both with no healing. So let's go after Aurora first. Yeah, Cactus is going to be very poison based. If we get through Aurora, we got two heals we can use, depending on how it goes. Alright, so that's a six. We can do that right away with the spatula. Put that there. That's a four. We can flip that for recover three. Get a one. Uh, we flip that for a six. Maybe I should have done that. We'll see. Get a four. Let's take the four on here. Let's take the six on here. We'll take one of the six for later. We'll do this one here. Okay, that's fine. Ended up all right. All right, she's got a lot of good moves usually. Freeze, okay. More freeze and more freeze. Damn. Wow. Okay, we're gonna end up with three freeze here, which means we get a lot of mechanical arm damage, which is nice. We can auto roll as well. Probably should. Okay. We can heal back. We can flip this to a three. Heal there. We need an even for there. A two is probably good there. Or we we wait. We flip this two to a five, we get max damage on that. We still need it even for that seven damage there. Let's flip this to a five. And we're gonna need to flip to six. Okay. So we go five here for damage. We go four here for the seven damage there. We get that here. Now there's still a chance. There's still a chance she wins this turn. We'll see. There's still a big chance we lose. She's gonna heal back six. Locks one dice. Okay. That's not that bad. First roll's gonna be locked. That's good. Alright. I think we flip this to a three. Heal. Um. We have to roll a four here to hit the jackpot. I don't know if we will. So let's do the max four damage here. It's not bad. Flip that for a six. Got a two. Flip that for a six there. We hope for rolling a one here. Oh my god. The game really loves me right now. The game really loves me right now. Um, as I was saying, unlucky was the, the theme last last episode. Now it's like the game's just like, okay, he's had enough. He's learned his lesson. Uh, let's regen, then we'll flip this order to six and play it there. Beautiful. It's like, it's like, it's like new. It's like, okay, he needs a one here to, to survive. This is, this is the only way it's going to seem fair. So we like, they, they, they just, maybe they string me along a little bit here. Double dice value, max of three. I don't know. We need seven still, right? So let's go through... Rhino Beetle. Should we do both healings? I think we do. He's pretty tough. He has a devastating attack. Alright. Let's go after him first because we have the most health possible. Alright. Three. Six. Got the six here. Let's play the three here. Unless we flip that to uh Yeah, we do that instead. We need everything we can get. Flip that to a six and play it... Not a great start, but... Okay, so that's a max four. That's good. Fours are dangerous. Fours do eight. Get the max there. Uh, we're at even here. It's one, two, three, four, five. We're probably going to be okay there. Let's 
flip it and save the six for here just in case. Got a one. Let's flip that. Save the do the six over here. Two. Six there. I'm alright with that. Alright. That was really good. Eight damage lock of dice. Damn. At least we can auto roll. That's good. That's great. Regen. Get the three max there. Okay. It's a good start. Uh, flip this to a six for over here. Put this for seven here. Uh, three and five. Let's see. Make this a five and a three. Here we go. All right. We're in pretty good shape. We're at 25. That's pretty good. What do we got here? Raygon for headbutt. We didn't take the deal last time. I don't have room for it for the most part. Do X damage, two uses this turn. With spatula. Any ones we have become sixes. We do six damage twice with the, with the headbutt. Compared to the Raygon. We do three damage with, with... Yeah, I think we do it. I think we do it, and we see what we can get rid of. I think we do that. Because the spatula let us flip any ones. Ones are pretty frequent. I'm going to try it. We didn't take it last time. I think we should, though. I think we should have. Okay, here we go. Cactus. He's got poison attacks. No, he doesn't. He has thorns. That's right. Thorns. That's his deal. Um, so we got to do this battle quickly or carefully. All right. So we had a five there. We flip to a six. We get that there. We get some healing back there. Uh, we do this. Oh, only... We can't do that. We put this... Um, we save it for over here. We do the six here. Going more. We flip that to a four. We do four damage here or, six, or five damage here. We do five damage there. Hope for a one. Okay. It's all right. Not a bad roll. See, now he's got all those thorns. He does some serious damage. Now we focus on our healing, though, I think. We do maximum damage as possible. We maximum healing, though. That's the goal. Then we try to get maximum damage here. So we get a six. For four cost. We do level up at the end of this, though. So that takes him down to 13. One, two, three, four, five to 13. Oh, lucky. Okay. So we can get 11 damage there. Plus the 5. The 5 will probably do 4 to us. So that's... We have 11 damage, 16 damage, plus another 5 damage from this one. I think we can get there. We're going to take 16 damage to the process. That did damage to us. 6. Oh, we got an auto, auto roll. I don't know if that worked or not. We do five and four will be enough, right? Or five and five will be enough. Okay. As long as we're leveling up here and I calculated properly. Okay, we did. Okay, good. Increment. CPU counter plus one. Two uses this turn. It's basically more dice rolls. Heat sink we took. I mean, take, take the increment this time. All right. I don't know what I, what I put it on. Healing crystal is too important. We can't rely on just headbutt and sword and buster sword. We have a little bit low a damage output right now. I don't know. All right. Mechanical arc could be devastating if he freezes us. I'm gonna try this. 
We also have our auto roll. And he's got a lot of freeze with a lot of damage. That's great. Okay, we got a lot of options here. It's six there. We flip. It's six there for max. We flip. We get six there for max. We flip. We get six there for doesn't matter. We do healing back two doesn't matter. Take a lucky shot. That's pretty good. Pretty good turn. All right. Now here, he's gonna freeze us a bunch. We'll have our auto roll. I might save it actually, because we're gonna have a lot of damage here. Uh, so we need an even for here to do six damage, right? And then we flip this to be a six. We flip this to be a six. We should get the healing back first, and then we slip, then we do the six. Yeah, and we save the auto roll for next turn. All right, paper knight next, I think. Then we have some. Then we have. Oh, we check in here first. That's what this is. So we have healing if we want it for one gold. Jungle ball spike shield. Let's do it. Spike shield's an interesting one. Max 5, we can basically get that anytime we want. Otherwise, juggling ball, do X damage with a max of 3. Up to 3 damage, you get the new dice. I don't know. Let's go after Paper Knight. I don't think I want any of those right now. Maybe upgraded? I don't know. Okay. Let's see what we got here first. Let's go for maximum damage first. Let's go. Oh, we need evens for that though, right? So we need even for this. We five. We flip these to fours. Those to fours. Um, let's see. Let's do one more roll. All right. For me. All right. Two locks, okay. That's not good. Oh, it's only locked two turns, okay. That's, that's two dice, it seems like. Ah, oh, boy, what do we even do here? Let's heal back first. We might not get another opportunity. Ooh, that was lucky. Okay. How do we get max damage here? We just take the four, I guess, and then do lucky shots or heal back. I think healing's pretty important here right now. It's gonna be a few more turns anyways, so let's do it, let's do it. Luckily, she only has one attack, right? If she rolls odd, we get two locks. Not the end of the world. And, okay, that's good. I'm gonna save the auto roll for now. Okay, we're up to four. Let's put this here. Let's flip this and put this here. Roll one more and put that there. Okay. All right. So one damage, two lock again. Nice. Very good. Very good. Pretty safe still. We got okay. Now we're now it's not not so safe. Uh, flip this upside down for a six. That there. Oh, I should waited on that actually. I could have done something else. Uh, let's flip this. For a retreat to the healing, let's get the healing. Debating for you auto roll. If I do five there, takes her to seven. I'll auto roll a three. 
I could flip it to a four, play it here. Yeah, I think I do it. And then I get to do my option of, I'll do four damage and I'll do the lucky shot. Yeah. All right, we're through it. For better or worse, we're through it. We didn't heal back a lot, but we do have healing here. Upgrades. All right. Headbutt upgraded. What does it become? Even plus one, two uses this turn. So it can do up to up to 14 damage then? We two, put two sixes in there? Otherwise, mechanical arm or healing crystal. Eh, no. Buster store up, maybe. This can do up to 14 damage. This will do up to... This will do up to 14 damage, but we have to be able to play maximum on it. Which is pretty likely that we'll get that. Then this one will be every single turn we get up to... We get Basically, we get 8 damage off of that. Uh, I don't know. It's a 2 anyways, either way. Here we're counting on 1 good dice, here we're counting on 2 good dice. I think this is probably the way to go, is just that. This hasn't really affect us, it affected us at all, I think. I think we go Buster Sword. Otherwise, look at Backpack. Let's see, Plasma Blaster going to do X damage. Nope. Cheat code. Crisis range by 2. Increment. Reusable. Counter by 1. I don't think that's great. No, because you can't really play that too many times. All right, let's just do the Buster Sword up. Okay. I think every single time we've won, though, we've done the Buster Sword up. Maybe it's a good thing. Okay, we got 10 health down. We're going into Crystallina. Crystallina can be very tough, but we'll see what happens. Okay, 52 health. Not great. Um, let's get maximum damage there right away. Got two, okay. Let's go one more time. Oh, that's pretty solid, okay. see I do lucky shot for five and put to five with the buster sword it's seven so we got 12 damage plus the two into the, the mechanical arm for another four damage that's what we do otherwise I flip two no it's not gonna work that way flip two to five doesn't really help me at all okay gotta do it that way lucky shot that and this and then I think from now on we'll, we'll, really, we'll be healing I think depending on what these rolls are I mean we would get lucky here that's pretty bad that's pretty good okay that's okay that's an okay one we'll flip that to a six get max damage there we'll hang on to this guy for here for now got a four And then Rex will roll a three if we if we hit the jackpot. I think we gotta focus on healing, like I said. We bust, that's okay. So I got seven on that. There's little else we could have done. Take six damage, interesting. Curse enemy, okay. It's not the end of the world. Okay, we have an auto roll. that out there. Get that out there. Okay. That's fine. Other things that are going to happen, I like I like that one best. We just need a three or better. We got her. That'll work. Okay. 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 All right. I'm liking where this is going. I feel like we're going to lose the boss fight now. I just don't feel like our damage output's high enough. Singer. All comes down to this. We've, we've struggled against the singer in the past. We do have an auto roll going in, which is great. So we get. So we have two fives. I think we regen here. We flip this to a six. We get max damage there. We put the five into here. 
we put the even into here. We flip to a two and do the healing here. So we do. All right. We got the weekend is tough. Some pretty good rolls there. Two weekend. Okay. Needs a six. All right. Minimum four. This is only for reducing dice down. Then we get the six here. The healing here. That's fine. We rolled a big number. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. That's a bad roll for us. Ooh, that's a bad roll. Well, she didn't do it right. I would have taken the 15 damage, personally. That would have been devastating. Maybe she thinks she's gonna get another turn here. Let's auto roll. I don't think I don't take any chances. Alright, we go here for that. We flip this guy to a six. We flip this to a five. We have the six here. With the four here. The four here. Oh, we just need a little bit more. Love it. Got it. Okay. I said I wasn't loving our damage output, but I'm, I'm certainly liking it now. Two extra CPU is great. Um, and we get a nudge. There's not really anything I could put it under. I gotta keep this healing crystal just in case. I think we'll have to stick with what we got. All right, boss fight time. Hopefully it's not something too bad. Versus what? S versus Audrey. Okay. It's nerd versus jock here. Robot versus Audrey. I like it. Okay, here we go. Here goes nothing. Audrey's gonna have a lot of health. Ready for a fight. She does stuff. Walloping attacks. 81 we gotta get through here. We have 15 target now though. Her attacks are what? 10 damage with uh, three equipment damage and nine damage. And then evens plus one. Oh my God. All right, five, throw that there. A one, flip that to a six, maximum damage there. Six, maximum damage there. Okay. Hopefully roll three. Nope, didn't get it, that's okay. Oh, I did, I should have done the six, that's right. One, one, if we lose by one, then we'll know why. Ow, bam, that hurts. Ooh, that hurts a lot. Luckily, we got a lot of equipment. All right, we can flip these to sixes so we can actually do maximum damage there still. It's pretty great. Uh, let's heal back the three. We have a max three there. It is a six there, we can't get that one. Let's get the max for that at least. I think I do have to heal back. It's gonna, it's gonna matter. It's gonna come, it's gonna come down to the very, very end here. All right. That's pretty decent for us, I think. Interesting, interesting tactic. She wants the weekend for sure. Okay, well we can work with that. So it's if we can basically flip this five to a two if we want to. Not the point of that. We're at nine. Rolling six would be perfect here. Okay, that's all right. We save the five for here. That's all we can do, unfortunately. Yep. All right, down to forty-seven. You gonna do really loves that weekend okay max two there auto roll it yep we got to take the healing need it uh we go we're gonna get maximum damage here really flip this oh we can't flip that one we can go like this though get that one there get that one there we do three here. Hanging on. I mean, she can't kill us this turn. She can get real close, though. Ouch. All right, auto roll it. At least we're hitting that auto roll every single time. 
Heal back. Heal back. That's all we can do. Now, now it's now it's in Lady Luck's hands here. Damage over here is only six. Is our max. It's gonna come down to the very end. She might have enough. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wow. That run. We're gonna be stuck at the robot forever, guys. I feel like we did basically all we could. I can, I can think back to maybe two misplays, unless I missed something. There was like two misplays. I'm gonna say two. Any more than that, and you're wrong. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back for another one of the robots runs here next time. We'll get it. We'll get it next time. Robot, we're, we're, we're like two rolls away from winning, I think. We'll see. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching once again, and I'll be back for more next time. Bye.